Get any side quests now. Oh. Dear, dear me. What am I going to do? Oh, if it is ambitious. I am along just at the right time. I had a favor to ask you, sir. The other day I was playing with my lad, you know. Pressing around as you do. Well, anyway, we got this fur. Glory feather that he loves and well, cool that I am, and I'm just gonna let it blow away. Luckily the one want... oh, I think I already got it. Yep. <coughs> yeah, so oh, I already got it. Well, it's good to see that that sound is still the same. Right. Well, that was the first side quest. I th think that item is a... Um, a material for uh, crafting. That's how they block. You're just a little boy. The next you're getting ready to leave us. I only wish your grandfather could see what a fine young man you've become. To think, it's been so many years already since old Chalky found you floating in... in, in uh, I mean, since he brought you to Cobblestone. We never thought there was anything out of the ordinary about you. And now suddenly there's all this talk of luminaries, of all things. You know who the luminary was, of course. The legendary hero who saved the world from a terrible darkness. 
<laughs> We're supposed to believe that you're him reincarnated? <laughs> I don't doubt old Chalky, of course, but it is a little hard to swallow, I must say. Oh, when you meet the King of Heliodor, put in a good word for old Cobblestone, won't you, eh? <laughs> if he finds out this is the village where the luminary was raised, there might be something in it for us, <laughs> if you catch my drift. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you I are do. terrible. Trust you to be thinking about what you can get out of it. Oh, no, I'm only joking, of course. The I very know. thought. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Now, the fate that awaits you may well be one beyond anything we simple country folk can imagine. But you must allow us to offer what little assistance we can. Take this map of Erdria with you. May it prove useful in finding your way. Alright. I should not have said that now. Oh, it's my horse. Uh, oh. And may this magnificent steed, the pride of cobblestone, lighten your burden and speed you on your way. You'll find Heliodor easily enough. Just head north out of the village and follow your nose. <laughs> you travel safely now. Oh, you're such a good boy, such a good boy. You make us proud out there, won't you? And come back safe. Here, take this with you. I... I made it for you. Oh. It'll keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Be sure to keep it close, won't you? Oh, I don't know what's in store for you out there. But wherever you go and whoever you meet, don't... Don't forget us, will you? I Take care, you. and remember, we'll be waiting for you. Ready, oh. Sweet. All right. Horses are incredibly convenient way to cover large amounts of ground in very little time. They will sometimes have to enter areas that only be explored on foot. What is true though? A ring on many of the flamingos started around the Gia. They will soon bring your faithful friend galloping back to your side. So that's the bell. So if I remember right, there was another thing with the horses when it comes to the fight. Um, if you're galloping, you can actually just run right through them. Granted, it won't net you any experience, but... <laughs> uh, I like that. So I don't know if I actually damaged them. But that's fine. <laughs> Go ahead and waste your turn doing that. You're dead now. Oh, really? So I got no experience from that? Shit. Did I at least get money? Okay, so then they have roughly like... 9 HP? Maybe? Damn. Well, at least 
like this, I am able to, um... Uh, I'm more close. Where am I? Oh, it's the bottom. Um, I guess I could try that one. Oh yeah, so at least... Uh, okay. I really didn't think I would stop getting experience from these guys so soon. And... Uh, oh. Okay. Did not see that. Time to get going! Hi, who's over? Away! I think we should be able to jump down there or something. Oh, well, I was kind of wanting to fight you. Oh, look, it's, uh, Jackie. And I think they have access to three. I hope they can fuck out. They are defeated. Wow, so even the new enemy is still too weak for me to get experience from. Well, this is definitely gonna make the game interesting. Is that a cucumber? That is... Today. Cool. <laughs> it's a pretty uh brutal defeat. But the spear comes up and lands in the middle of their chest. I think if you attack him in the back like that, you should do some extra damage. Oof. Okay. Oh, miss. Yeah, that's pretty... pretty bad. Oh, damn. At least with this, I don't have to worry about over-leveling, but I'll at least still have um, a sufficient way to get money without the fear of over-leveling and making everything way too easy. Ooh, Seed of Life. Life by five. Bam! I didn't get any resilience. Shit. Okay, resilience is basically defense, agility, self-explanatory. Deftness is like critical hit rate, or yeah, something along those lines. Uh, the charm. I'm not sure what the use of charm is. If it's anything like in uh, Dragon Quest six and seven, there's like a small chance that you'll be able to essentially interrupt the enemy's turn with like how nice you look or something along those lines. So like I said, I just don't know how that works in this game. You know what? 
It's burning. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess that makes sense, you know, to thunder. Because they're kind of watery. So they take like half damage from fire abilities. 